The Wii U isn't the latest console in the Nintendo lineup, but it is still a great system and it has some awesome games on it. Today I will show you how to get the SEMA Wii U emulator, which already supports a lot of games and they update pretty regularly, so you can expect more games to be compatible pretty soon. I will also show you how to get the graphics packs and how to get the SEMA hook for a more stable emulator and better graphics. If you want to search what uh, kind of games are compatible, you can go into compatibility. Over here you can filter on perfect, playable and other things. I recommend playing perfect or playable games and your luck may vary if the games run. But most of the time these are pretty crappy and I don't recommend it. So for example if you click M you can see some Mario games. And I already see there also are some games like Rio Edit. They weren't in the last time. So first of all go to the SEMA website, it's SEMA.info and the link will be down in the description below like always. Scroll down and click download the latest version. Here go to the folder you want to have it in, I have emulator and Wii U. And save it. Now go to the wiki. Over here you can see uh, an extension, it is the SEMA hook. Just click it and click download over here. This will make it a lot more stable and it's pretty good. So of course get the latest version and also save this one. If you click community you can go to the forums. If you are at the forums you can go to the graphics specs over here. Go to the graphics spec github and the github pages. I recommend downloading them all and I didn't find a quick way to download individual ones. But just download them all. And save it again. So now everything is saved. I recommend getting WinRAR. I will leave a link in the description below to check it out. And you can extract the files. I am going to extract this one in Simu. Simu. And as you can see here is the emulator. I'm going to open it up after a while and first I'm going to show you how to add the extensions. So the SEMA hook, I'm going to extract it right here. And as you can see these things are the things you will get. So copy them, go to SEMU and put them in here. So I'm going to delete this one but it doesn't really matter. And now for the graphics specs, I'm going to extract them. This will take a while because there are a lot of things in there. And as you can see there are a ton. I recommend actually searching for a game. So if you want to play a Mario game. Mario. Alright so I didn't know what happened but I couldn't really find them. Um, over here you can select the resolution you want. You have 1080p and you have 1080p ultralight. Myself I have a normal 1080p screen. So open it up and here are the rules. You don't really have to change anything. It is just uh, better graphics and some better shadows and all that stuff. Which is great. Just select the one you want, copy it. Go into, into your CMU folder and put it in graphics pack. So now for the actual setup. If you have everything set up, you have your folder with all these things ready. Double click CMU and it will launch. Here it says you are missing some fonts, just click download now and it will download it automatically. This is pretty fast. And over here are the settings. And I don't know what this does. You also don't need to do anything in the debug section. You just leave it as this and if there are some fixes for games online, you can of course use those. For tools there aren't any ready for me yet. I think the memory searcher is if you want to mod games and use cheats. For the options I recommend enabling vSync, it is necessary. I also enable full screen myself. And over here you have the graphics specs and over here you can see it is Mario. This is one ga game I have myself and I want to play it on high quality. So here you have the upscaling factor. And the full screen uh, scaling, GPU buffer, separate gamepad view, audio settings, um, all of these you don't have to change at all. 
Um, if you have a motion source, you can use that one, but I don't have any. Experimental, you can enable these things if you want to try them. I recommend leaving them as it is right now. Your region, I always keep it at auto, so if you play a game from another region, it is the same. And my language is of course English, and you can change it to whatever language is in here. So for the input settings, I have a Xbox 360 controller. So over here you can see the controllers, and my profile will be Xbox 360. And I will emulate the Pro Controller, I think. Over here you can uh, select direct input, X input and keyboard. For me this will be X input, my controller. And A is A, B is B, X, 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 and yeah, you can yourself. So once you have set it up, I recommend saving it, so if you want to use it again, you can just select this one and it automatically works. So I'm now going to close this. Click file and here you can install a game update or DLC even. Myself I haven't used this feature because I didn't have to. But it is great it is already in there. So load and now select your game. For me this emulator, Wii U, Simu, Simu. Or not, oh it's over here. So here's my ROM. It's Mario. And if you dump it, it will be in code and over here the RPX file. Open it up and it will start.